This is a short clip from today's podcast episode. What about like here in Southern California? They do, they put a lot of water heaters in interior closets. Mm -hmm. I don't know if that's a thing out by you at all, but I find it kind of weird. And for tankless, you know, tankless can get noisy and stuff. And whereas, you know, a tank does not. So people get a little shocked sometimes by the noise coming out of that thing. Can you put a heat pump in, a, in an interior closet also? or As long as there's enough, as long as you have enough free air, you can. So, so maybe the duct, like you were saying. Might either be ducted or we put them in, we do put them into closets and those closets being, you know, pretty small. Yeah. What we'll do is simply put a full, we'll change the door, which is say a full louvered door. I see. And then it has free, it has all the free air exchange it needs and, uh, and you can do it that way. Gotcha. Either that or you can uh, duct it. You can duct it to a, uh, in and out of an attic or through it or whatever. As long as it has the free air to move, you're good to go. Gotcha. Yeah, I appreciate that. But they are quieter than a tankless unit. Oh, yeah. I should have asked that. Mm -hmm. So quieter than that, but not, you know, the, the silence almost of a, uh, a traditional tank style. No, they're not. They're not quite as quiet because... Really, the only thing you have moving is the fan. So, uh, you know, if you start hearing noise, it's usually because the bearings on the fan are, are going out or you're getting ready to have to change. Oh, I got gotcha. you. And that's not changeable? You got to change out the whole unit usually? Or no, the most bearing? of the time you can change that. You can change the fan. A couple of, uh, a couple of brands, uh, it makes it a little bit more difficult. But I would say probably in the last 12 years, we have changed two fans. Oh, nice. So Great. they Dependable. don't, yeah, they, they, get, they work pretty good. So. Nice. Yeah. Well, they're definitely getting popular. So it's something for the guys and girls out there to look into. Uh, oh, absolutely. Into. And uh, because they're getting a lot more efficient and they're able to do it faster and heat the water up faster, uh, people are starting to uh, put like recirculating on it and, nice. and other things. But, uh, you know, that. You got to upsize your heater if you're going to put it, if you're going to put recirculating onto it. Oh, there you go. Another tip.